And new at five, we're getting our first look at the man accused of shooting his son on Father's Day. He faced a judge in Redford Township today. Seven Action News reporter Nima Shafe was in the courtroom and has the latest. That's Howard Lowry Sr., the man charged with shooting his 23-year-old son on Father's Day at his Redford Township home. Inside the courtroom, the family of Sr. appeared to be in shock. Judge Charlotte Worth reading the charges to Lowry, who appeared by video arraignment, the video poor. Among the charges he's facing, four felonies, one misdemeanor, two counts of assault with intent to murder, both carrying possible life in prison sentences. Felony firearm, felon in possession of a firearm, and a charge of child abuse. Police say it all stemmed from a fight on Father's Day inside his home when his 23 year old son attempted to stop him from beating his younger brother, who's 16. Larry Sr.'s attorney even tried pushing for a lower bond amount, saying his client wasn't a flight risk. He's lived in Redford over six years, he's lived in the community his whole life in Detroit for the past 16. He runs his own business. But he has a prior history dating back to 1996 when he was caught carrying a gun without a license. I am going to set a million dollar cash assurity bond on recommendation. Redford Township Police telling me his son remains in intensive care but is now in stable condition. Lowry Sr. is due back in court on July 5th. We're in Redford Township. I'm Nima Shafe, 7 Action News. With a man accused